Samsung One UI 7 has some exciting and unique features. But let's be honest, some elements definitely seem copied from iOS. So it is time to compare One UI 7 with iOS 18 and find out which one is Have you better. Ever heard me beatbox? I could do this all day. Cats and boots and cats and boots and cats and So yeah, starting things with the lock screen, the iOS 18 can only customize clock font and color. The One UI 7 on the other hand can not just change clock font color but there are tons of different clock styles to pick from that with nice AOD to lock screen animation. The best part is you guys can adjust the clock position, something missing from iOS. The One UI 7 allows you to change the notification style for lock screen. It uses AI to suggest lock screen setup ideas. So a next level customization you get in there. Now I'm gonna show you some features which Samsung literally copied from iOS. Samsung went a step ahead and made its own version of live activities, the Samsung Now Bar. So the Samsung Now Bar is a pill shape interface which shows live activities like music with a nice iOS -ish expand and shrink animation. Then there is a charging animation which again is somewhat inspired by iOS Dynamic Island. Interesting part is Samsung didn't stop there but also copied the iOS Dynamic Island style notifications when on the home screen. Here's iOS 18 icons versus Samsung One UI 7 icons and I think iOS did better in terms of dark icons but Samsung is way better when it comes to normal and colored icons. I like how Samsung got widgets of all size and shape including 1x2. This application draw in Samsung One UI 7 with horizontal and vertical scrolling as well. So I think One UI 7 is clean and did better in terms of home screen and icons. Samsung One UI 7 got this different page notification and control center panel similar to the iOS 18. The new control center can be customized. You guys can drag and change the layout of quick settings again similar to iOS 18. But looks wise I feel Samsung is cleaner and elegant and iOS 18 is more customizable thanks to multi-page control center. Siri vs Bixby and no doubt Siri is superior can do system level tasks but Bixby can do better human like conversation something missing from Siri. It was all a dream, this virtual assistant scheme. Texting, your gym jams flexing in my subroutines. You want to know what the French word is for toe. You got quest chins, best turn up my flow. His story can be a mystery. I'm a voice in the cloud that wants to make your day a little more awesome. I'm Siri, your virtual assistant. Hi, Bixby. Not exactly, but I offer no resistance to helpful assistance. Now we'll compare the interface and animations. The volume control interface definitely better in Samsung One UI 7. You guys can adjust volumes of five different settings. Parky interface. Apple Intelligence versus Galaxy AI animation and this is again copied from iOS. Now some apps and their opening and closing animation. Let me know in the comment section which do you think is faster and smoother.
So this is all guys, I think when UI 7 is smooth, fast and got tons of customization options and just cannot ignore good luck which is a paradise of customization. Samsung got heavily inspired by iOS, we just cannot deny that but they made the one UI interface better, interactive and more user friendly. The iOS 18 is decent, fast and smooth. iOS 18 support live activities or even third party applications, something missing from one UI 7 as of now. So can we said iOS is more mature and reliable than when UI. This is all guys thanks so much for watching and I'll meet you guys in the next one. Like share subscribe and peace out.